What's up, people? Oh, am I here? And this is The Last of Us, a uh, grounded difficulty walkthrough. Uh, this is, I guess you can call it chapter two. Um, so we're outside now. Um, like I say chapter two because I, I, the beginning part with young Joel like 20 years ago, that's like the prologue and then, um, And the first part in, in the city is like part is like chapter one and this is chapter two I guess or something um, I consider the the seasons like a was it fall winter or was it summer fall winter and then spring those are like act one act two act three type scenarios at least in my head that's the way I class them as um, but for this section, this is not too difficult to navigate. Um, that guy I walked under, sometimes if your timing is wrong, he, he will spot you and you're basically fucked at that point. So um, it's all about making sure that when you pass under him, he's looking outward and he hasn't like swept down yet um i i think the first time i played through i i fucked up the the timing of the way he was looking he just immediately opened fire on me and killed me so from that point on i always was very careful uh walking under him and then, um, basically just have to wait for those guys to get the fuck out of there, and, um, there's a desk through the window, there's like a desk or something that you can open, but, um, there's just nothing there. I don't even think on lower difficulties there's anything there, it's just one of those things where it's like, the game is like, hey look, you can open this out, haha, <laughs> nothing's there, so. But, um. When you get into this area, you can run like about half of this area, and um, if you don't have like a brick or a bottle of sun, there's plenty of them to pick up. And once you get here, you want to like crouch walk, and then you want to just throw a brick or bottle, whichever it is, right there, um, and then you can just crouch walk over here um, drop down here and then you can you're basically clear um, you once you get here you know you can just run down into this area and you never have to deal with those uh, those soldiers ever again um, uh, I think that the the running through half that area I think I discovered that from watching someone speed run the game and they ran like almost the entire area like I, and I was just amazed I was like wow I, I never thought to just like run to to all the way over into that um, truck area that I crawled that I climbed through and sure enough, on I think the first time I went through it on grounded, I gave it a shot, and it it fucking works. So, um, and um, I should mention that uh, I'm playing this game on an alternate profile just so I can show the the trophy pops for the difficulty, and I might get. A random trophy during this run um, I might end up for like the crafting items or something I might have one of those pop I'm not sure but uh, on my main profile I have the 100% completion on this thing on the PS4 and I almost have the whole thing on the PS3 um, I just need to 
do some of the the faction multiplayer stuff and uh I've actually been slacking on the PS3 version. I need to finish up the 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 rally faction or whatever it is, completing the the 12 weeks for each faction. I have one of them. And I need to. I think I need to finish the Firefly or the Hunters. I can't remember or um whichever it is. And then I gotta do the miscellaneous DLC trophies which they actually made easier on the ps4 version um the ps3 version is bullshit because you have to get three downs or executions without dying during the match and then thankfully with the ps4 version they just made it five downs of executions throughout the match and they took out the no dying bullshit so basically the ps3 version i just need to boost those because trying to not die legitimately in a round of that that multiplayer is almost impossible um i'm good but i'm not that damn good so i i've been slacking on that but um uh when you get here uh this is i think this is the introduction to the shiv doors um you don't have to open this one. Um, there's only like two things to pick up. But I did it anyway just because I eventually I'm gonna need the supplies and the the health items for upgrades. So um, you can open that door or you don't have to. It really doesn't matter. Um, and then coming up here I'm gonna bash this clicker's head in because apparently I, I never knew this but if you have like a brick and you go up to a clicker while it's just kind of walking around you can hit it three times and kill it with a brick so enjoy that <laughs> 